Good uh, morning, guys. Today is hot. It literally feels like a, like a sunny, hot day, and we're like dressed in sweaters. I'm already sweating. I are can't you... wait for winter where I can wear t-shirts finally. <laughs> My kids are mixed up. But anyway, welcome to today. Well, when today. I ride in the winter, it's hot, so I wear t-shirts. Anyway, welcome to today's video. Today, we're gonna do something that I've been wanting to do. All right, so it's Gracie at the door today. <laughs> Clean barn, happy life. That's what happens when your barn is kind of clean. I still have to go through stuff, but if you missed yesterday's video, we cleaned the barn, finally. What did you do yesterday, Sophie? Oh my gosh, I need to clean up the poop again. I made a mud pit. Yeah, oh yeah, so Sophie made a mud pit yesterday. You know how I always say that we like to do different things and leave different things in the barn for the horses to like play with and stuff when we're not here. Well, Sophie left a, a pool. She put a pool, a flood of water yesterday. Honey liked it. Yeah, and Honey went right through the water, didn't she? Yeah, she just like, can I come Where do you want to put it? Where are we going to put? So today's video is about putting something new in the arena for our horses. I don't want to put it in the way or something. No, I feel like down in that corner. Willow was becoming a tree. Typically the horses poop in the far back. Let's just move it away from the corner or right on the corner? i move it away from the corner. Or, or right in the corner. What do you think? Let's get it all set up and we'll just move it around and see what we think. Sophie and I are going to go get the thing. Oh, I don't want to block off the middle of the arena. No, we want to not have it all blocked off in here. This is actually going to take some hard labor. We picked like the hottest day of the fall for hard labor. Uh, Sophie, do you love that halter that someone gave you? Yes. My friend Honey Heather? Loves Honey loves it too, yeah. Sophie's obsessed. Like yeah, she has one for her. Yeah, things. everybody loves the baby and now. All right, come in for a brush. Right, in for a brush. And Willow's coming in for a brush too. Give Willow a pet. She's standing right I there. Oh. She was the first one to pet. I know, people will be saying, you don't love Willow anymore. Well, yeah, we have a lot of it, videos on Willow. <laughs> We have a lot of videos on Willow. We don't have very many videos on Honey yet. So basically, we're gonna put, set up something new in the arena to play with with our horses. We're gonna leave it there all winter. It's gonna be a big job. Look how big this extra field is here that Sam's been building. Like we can move our fencing back and let the horses have a bigger spot for winter. I don't know if you guys can tell, but the thing that's happening is already scaring Chino. He's, he was, he's watching Gabby. Yeah, he ran up to the fence. He looked at the new thing and then he went, nay, and ran off. And Penny's watching too. Penny loves her mama time. So uh, this is our arena and this back little bit right here is usually where our horses poop when they come in the arena. Uh, our horses can choose to go inside or outside depending on what they want to do. Right now they're all outside. But I want to set this place up, this indoor, so that they have moot, so that they have room to move around this winter, but I also want them to have things that like stimulate them and that they can they can explore when we're not always in the arena with them. We are in the arena a lot with them though. I'm pouring sweat like I can't get over it. It's November and I'm pouring sweat. We often use these little jump standards. If you can see, they're almost all on the ground. It's because Penny goes around and pushes them over. We have a rain barrel. We're gonna go get the other one and bring it in probably. And we have some poles. We have this little bridge over on this end and we're gonna add something to this little corner over here. This is a clue. I feel like long-term viewers will know. This one's easier to balance on. Yeah, we should do that again. Balance. Let's put it over there with our other barrel. We've been collecting so much stuff and we hardly used it all summer. We have another one of these. Do we? White. Where is it? It's all the way down there. All right, we gotta go get it. Let's go. You guys, I like am blown away by the level of how awesome it is that this happens so easy. Like we have this fool out here just wandering around with the rest, most of the herd and happy they're all happy and we had almost zero incidents there was like a, maybe two squeals of all I don't like me anymore she's in with the herd. yeah i'm like sophie she might not like you anymore when she's in with the herd but yeah she's, 
Sophie's still our favorite person. If any of you guys are wondering, like how much does a horse actually poop each day? Like how much could it be? I take at least one of these big buckets, muck buckets, out of the outdoor, like out of this area every single day. Every day I take at least one, usually two. I come out every day and the whole entire area has got so much poop in it. Like it never ends. Never ever catch honey's zoomies on camera. I'm just always like, we're always just like, wow, he's so cute when she's running. Already the horses are excited about the bucket that I, the wheelbarrow that I brought in. That's what I mean. Like every time you bring something, uh oh. <laughs> Gracie's like, this is my wheelbarrow. <laughs> every time you bring something new into the arena, they get so excited. And that's what spurs us to like, make this environment more happy for them especially through the long time of winter and i want to make it into a way that we can work with them yes we still love willow we love willow yes we do you're the cutest baby you are she is such a cute girl i've noticed the last few days that willow has really been taking to honey and treating her more like a baby like she still doesn't love her like she's not gentle and soft like like Gracie is, which who ever would have thought that? I never would have thought Gracie would be like that. Gracie's always the instigator. Uh-oh, don't tip it over. She's always the instigator. She's always the troublemaker. She's always like the one that is the worst behaved. Okay, so why did you put makeup on? Yeah, I just washed my hands and now I see my arm is still dirty. This has been a slave labor at its finest. I thought you decided to do this. I did. I was like, you know what? Today's the day. Today's the day we need to do this because we have plans tomorrow. And I really wanted to do this. I've been like dying to do this for so long. I did not know it was gonna take that much labor. We're still at it. We're like three dump loads of dirt into the arena already. So Sophie and I did what any self-respecting woman would do. What are we doing, Sophie? Getting food. <laughs> get dinner the closest way to get away from sam is to offer to go buy food so we're going to buy food well, <laughs> we're gonna go get some idea to do this so why'd you do that because yeah. sometimes you have to put hard work into life sophie like why do we still have pumpkins though? i don't like, know the pumpkins have got to go but anyways it's true i'm scorched i'm dirty we're going to into town to get lunch before we go sophie just found a dime and she said if you find a penny it's good luck what happens when you find a dime what, what happens What's when you find a dime? 10 cents. So, is it 10 times good luck? That's what I think. But no, because we have a here. This is good luck, and this is the same size, no, but a dime is old. smaller. Anyway, let's go. We are back. We brought lunch. I don't know if you guys can see. It's gonna be a big reveal as soon as we're done. Are we done? Sophie and I hurried as fast as we could. We did that. What? <laughs> we did. We need another load. We need another load? Okay, yeah. You want to go in the other room? We're going to have a lunch. We're going to have a picnic with the ponies. <laughs> it's Pop Willow. All right, let's go eat. Let's go in the other room. Gabby says her hands are brown. Welcome to the world of being a farm girl, so for Gabby. Yeah. All right, we're gonna have lunch. This is cute. Why did you put this here? This is my table. Yeah, this is the table. Here, take your pop. Oh, Sam's chair has like a little table attached and some chips here. Yeah, can you put mine up for me? We'll sit there and we'll have our little lunch in the barn. Good thing I cleaned it yesterday. Thank you. Oh, my body already aches.
have this little section right here, right when you come in the door, and it got a little bit low. So we're gonna build it up a bit. We're gonna build this sucker up, and then we're gonna do a big reveal. A little fall right beside us. I love us working as a family. Oh look, they share hay. Okay you guys, this is it. This is the grand reveal. This is the back end of our arena. Our arena's tiny, so we don't want to take up all the space, but we made this. I don't know if it's good or if we sucked. I'd like to paint that big tire. That might be a job for tomorrow. But this is it. This is our little climber. She's like, wow, this is fancy. So we packed it all down. We put a lot of dirt in there. It's a bit soft right now, but... Well, this might be a work in progress. <laughs> Our horses might not love it. We also leveled up, well we didn't level it, but we also dumped a bunch of dirt here. Sam's gonna fix it so that it's more level. I thank my little family so much for helping me with this. Wow! Look at that fancy girl! I knew this little mini would be the first one up. Good job! Yeah, look, it's holding up really good. Little teeny tiny pieces, because that's all I have. Yeah! So you add a treat to it? I'll take you again, Gracie. She's so much more willing. Yeah, she's so much more willing. Big jump. Yeah. <laughs> Good girl. Okay. Penny and Honey are over there eating together. Penny definitely treats her like she's a baby. Stay tuned for lots of, yeah. Stay tuned for lots of videos with this. Obviously it's gonna take a few minutes for our horses to get used to it. We, we pounded it down. You can see her feet aren't like caving in, but. <laughs> but it needs to like really settle. If nothing else, it's such a nice spot to sit. <laughs> All right, last try. Here, do you have the carrot? Here. Yeah! Good girl! Today is not the day that we work with the horses to try and get them on it. Today is just the day that we built it. Yeah! Good girl! Do you guys think that the small tires are too close? What is it, Penny Pickle? Look at those ears. Penny doesn't have to do it. I just want to show it to her before we leave. Come on. Come on. She doesn't have to do it. Well, like it's my turn? Yeah, there's a line up. <laughs> I say we just leave them here. <laughs> Let them explore. They'll explore and stand on it in their own. It will suck if we have to move them. Like we could have put them in a straight line so that we had better access to it because this is kind of on a curve. So I don't know if we'll have to fix it but i love it i'm happy with it <laughs> penny's like i am out of here <laughs> come on come on come on over the bridge come on you can do that good girl yeah come on good girl come on right over <laughs> come on come on Come on, yeah. Good girl. 
She's like, I like what I like. I just don't feel comfy with that thing yet, but she'll get there. That is it for today's video, you guys. It took us a long time. This little mini is just doing circles in front of me. She's like, I know you got Kate treats in your pocket. Yeah, she's spinning. She's just spinning, spinning. <laughs> nope, no treats, sorry. No treats, sorry. Don't you know that you're beautiful?